Hello YouTube followers, this is John Demokis, aka Half Man Half Cichlid. I'm kind of excited about producing this uh, video today and uh, sharing with you a very simple secret to solve a problem that has plagued me for nearly a year. I've mentioned in other videos that uh, for a number of reasons I've decided to uh, uh, convert all my aquariums away from uh, African cichlids, mainly because of the aggression, but there were a number of other problems. So anyway, the fish that you see in the aquarium behind me, this 340 gallon, are some of the really neat specimens that uh, I've replaced the Africans uh, with, and I covered what I have in this aquarium in other videos. But in any event, there was a, what I call sump baby African cichlid that grew up in my sump that carried over from when I used to have Africans, and he started to grow into a sizable and beautiful uh, uh, fish. The only problem was you've got this large aquarium and uh, he was so aggressive and with fish that were two and three times the size, uh, literally a third of the aquarium was uh, reserved for him because he would corral all of the rest of the fish to the rest of the aquarium and fiercely defend that one third of the aquarium on, uh, let's see here, on uh, this side over here that uh, he claimed for himself. But anyway, I had a brainstorm this morning, figured out a, a way to get, uh, get him out of there because as you can see from the complexity of this tank and the aquascaping, it's a very deep tank, like 38 inches, to take out all the driftwood, to take out all the live plants, uh, to lower the water level, the rocks, to lower the water to about 20% so I could catch this guy was a, more of an undertaking that I wanted to uh, 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 take on. So this has bugged me for the longest time. And, uh, and again, I got a brainstorm on how to do it, which I, I will share with you in this video. Here's the aquarium and the problem fish. You can see the uh, peacock looking uh, African, purple in color, has uh, corralled all of the fish to uh, the right side of the aquarium in the top. He's in essence uh, uh, removed uh, the other fish from about uh, about one third of the aquarium and on both sides of this big piece of fossilized coral. So anyway, if this is a problem, big problem for me, I've been trying to fix. Hopefully well, folks won't think this is too too mean, but believe me, you'll see it worked uh, pretty well. But I took a piece of fishing line and a small hook and a small sinker and decided to try to catch him with some bait. I tried to uh, record my actual uh, capturing and him going for the bait, but unfortunately my back was to the camera. So here I am taking the African uh, off the very small hook. And the really neat thing was uh, the hook had not even uh, pierced his uh, body. So you can see uh, the fish are of return to that side of the aquarium. I now have the jerk fish uh, removed. I put him into my uh, uh, 500 gal in the background that's got a, a number of other Africans. And uh, peace has been restored to uh, this aquarium. Appreciate uh, your input. This was too easy. Thank you.